Hey y'all. So today we're watching Hereditary. Now, uh, I personally have seen the kill count from Dead Meets Channel for this movie a couple years back. So I have a general idea about the movie. I don't remember much because I've avoided it since. Um, I only remember enough that I should prepare like this plushie with me. He, on the other hand, my brother has no idea what it's about. He doesn't know what to expect. So. I know it's famous. That's that's all I can really tell you. And the name of it, Hereditary, right? That I feel like it's something about family. That's that's my guess. So that that's it. That's my the extent of my speculation. I don't even know who's mm -hmm. in this. Like I'm, you said, Tony. Uh, Tony Collard. Tony like Collard. See, I don't know who Tony Collard is. <laughs> she was the mother in The Sixth Sense. Which you probably haven't seen in a while either. Yeah. I haven't seen that since I was a kid. I don't remember. Is that Bruce Willis's wife? <laughs> yes. I don't remember what she looks like. <laughs> That's all right. After this movie, you probably remember her. I only remember What's like supposed to mean? No. <laughs> two, three scenes from this movie. So, but other than that, I don't know any details. So, let's just enjoy the movie together. I'm uh, I'm excited. Oh, it's eight twenty-four. I forgot. Okay, so Ellen passed away. It seems like so many people passed away from this family. I also want to see uh, Midsummer. Mm. That's by A24 as well, I think. Yes. I like how the film just starts off so ominously. Wow, what a transition. Nice. Wow, that was so smooth. I can't even tell when the transition began there. It looks so tiny too, like even if miniatures. she's reflecting her room like that. Yeah. Crazy. This is for the funeral, right? Oh, I guess. Get up. Yeah, they're wearing well, that suits. That would make sense as to why they're wearing suits. My mother was a very secretive and private woman. We'll find out, I assume, why. Private rituals, private friends, private anxieties. When her life was unpolluted, she could be the sweetest, They wear the same necklace. Yeah, they are. So, yeah. yeah. Her daughter also and her... incredibly stubborn, which... Isn't this guy in Jumanji? The modern one? You've seen the first one, right? No. I don't remember. But that might be him. Wrong. Mm -hmm. Did they live together with just the mom? Oh. <laughs> just through toiling away at the hospice. Yeah, between this and the, uh, the preschool. So what's our deadline now? Seven months? Good night. Love you. Doesn't reply. Doesn't reply, yeah. Sound design in this film is really good already. I can tell. That's going to be used later, effectively. Yeah. Everything feels so empty. She wanted me to be a boy. Oh. You know, I was a tomboy when I was growing up. Well, that's ominous, <laughs> reading that. <laughs> what kind of mother will leave their daughter just kind of known? But it seems. <gasps> what the fuck? I'm too hard on her. Hmm. Because he literally refuses to look at all the signs that are being literally handed to him the entire play. Is she okay, talking about the that's movie? interesting, yeah. That's... <laughs> Never had hope because they're all just like hopeless. They're all like pawns in this horrible, hopeless machine. They're talking about the movie. Yeah, probably, yeah. What? Well, that's good. I'm 
Interesting shot. It looks like a miniature. Yeah, no, that's yeah. true, yeah. No. There was nothing. He disagreed with us. It's been a week. Uh, I'm gonna go see a movie. Okay. Is that a movie? Yeah. They're both lying to each other already. <laughs> Second time with us, the floor is There's open. an empty chair right there. Mm. Is that on purpose? I wonder if someone didn't come. Yep. Or she'll see somebody sitting there. Would you like to? Ah. Six soon, he hangs himself in her mother's bedroom, and of course, the suicide note blamed her, accusing her of putting people inside him. So He's really good in this. Or the empty chair is just that empty chair. <laughs> Might come into play later. Oh, oh this shot. Yeah, is there, yeah. Yeah, this shot. Literally. Maybe his friend will come up. Yeah. Huh? Who's outside? What? Their place smoking. The dog. She likes to draw every. What? What is that? Something hitting the light. Oh, that shot's like crazy. <laughs> crazy good. No drinking. We're not even old enough to get drinks if we wanted to. Well, that's a clock. I'm just asking if you're drinking. <laughs> they have shots of like the entire room. Just yeah, like so like they're in a miniature. Yeah. As if they're like puppets being moved around. Ah, uh, yes. I, I wonder Pawns if that's on purpose. Machine, yep. going she's going with you great he doesn't sound super happy yeah i really wasn't going to it's like a clock the same one as on the necklace ah. i didn't see the outline nice catch Why would you bring a kid to this? Yeah. He says school barbecue. Barbecue. <laughs> I like that shot. But I'm scared of... Jesus. I feel like this will come true later on. Oh yeah, for something. sure. Yeah. The other room has a bomb. Sick. Uh, okay. What about Charlie? Walk over and stand there and we'll give you a piece. But hurry up, they're gonna run out. Come on, Charlie. Looks so out of place. Yeah. I'll just... But does it have nuts? Yeah. Oh, good thinking. Uh... I think about that. I already thought the shot looked weird. Well, it's also kind of the mom's fault because she forced her to come along, even though Peter obviously didn't want her there. Yeah, and Charlie also seemed reluctant. Nice shot. It's so dark you can't see anything at all. Does he, they don't carry EpiPens in their car? That's, That's true, actually they, really they dumb. should, yeah. That's really dumb. He should have brought an extra one.
What the fuck? What the fuck? What the fuck? What the fuck? Does he know? Obviously he knows, right? I'm sorry. What the f- What the f? That was one of the scenes, but I thought it was in daytime. It really goes to show you that memories really do- are not accurate at all. Oh, that poor girl. <laughs> like, literally having an allergy attack and then dies to a pole. Fucking hell. That's like- That's like top 10 horrible deaths, I'm pretty sure. Fucking hell. Oh, and she cut off the bird's head and... Yeah. Did he... Did he, he just left her home? there? A straight home? I don't... I mean, he's a teenager. Uh... He should have called the police or something. I mean, they're not gonna take a very high... Good view on him driving home high. Oh. I forgot about that part. He was trying to get her to the hospital though, but my god. What's he gonna say? We have to see him tell his parents this news. No, they'll find they'll find. Yeah. Oh, that's so fucked up and sad. Wow. It's incredible, actually, in this role. Yeah. Mother's grief. He just drove home with her headless body there. Jesus. In the car. That is so fucked up beyond belief. Yeah. Zazz ass. There's some carving dolls. I saw the mom. But Charlie, dis uh, the mom discovered it in Charlie's room. She didn't uh -huh. know about it. She didn't knowingly know about it. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you don't know. I don't know what the hell's going on in this house. So bad for the dad too. Yeah. Uh. Oh, she had to see Grandma, maybe in a morbid way. <laughs> mm. <laughs> Sorry. Jeez. That's like the hater oh, fan, she, right? she went to the treehouse. Was that where Charlie was at the beginning of the movie? I guess. I thought that was the attic for some reason. Same. So I guess she wanted to... Because she knows Charlie. And it's cold in there. That's why she brought those. I wasn't supposed to focus on it anymore. <laughs> he killed his little sister. Fucking hell. Oh, uh, oh nice fucking... Oh, PTSD. GFX there. Uh, this whole family is... It's some good therapy. We're going there again? I lost my daughter. Next week. Oh, I lost my son. Next week. Oh, I lost no, my no. husband. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> Oh yeah, she is at the meeting. She should have talked about in. it. Yeah. Ah, uh, she's gonna keep that hidden. Keep expecting someone to stand there. Yeah, that's true. Like the way they just shot is really well done. Now that you mention it, like her mom. No. Oh. 
I really did forget something. My son died. Really nice of her. Really empathetic, yeah. Mm. Thank you. Really. Yeah, they only these two would understand each other's pain. Mm. And yeah, the way this is shot, every time I keep expecting something, they're really, really good at building tension. Mm. No, I haven't even talked to Peter at yeah, all there's been since no... this started. Yeah. Oh my god, this whole family's gonna kill themselves. <laughs> Over. Hey. Where's the heat? The smell is too warm. I don't know how I'm gonna enjoy another hour of this. <laughs> <laughs> There's so much tension. <laughs> so much pain. Man, though, this movie's so beautifully shot. The way like, she's looking at her. Yeah. How is your relationship with your son? That's a vivid sleepwalking. You can put down paint thinner on everyone and set a fire. You can kill everyone. Seriously. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. It's no wonder Peter was quite upset about that. planning on letting him see that no i made the dinner i came to get you come stay whatever you want i don't really give a shit he's he's not happy yeah you okay man oh no yeah he seems like he's bracing himself huh? am i okay let me think i just lost my daughter mm -hmm. Fucking shit. Don't you swear at me, you little shit! Don't you ever raise your voice at me! I am your mother! I can't forgive! Because. Because nobody admits anything they've done! This is the. He's like, he's kind of kind of blurry while she's in full focus. Mm -hmm. My camera shot. Interesting. The whole time he's been like that. So I thought it was a focusing problem. Mm. She didn't want what I wanted. Mm. Right. We're stuck in this right now. Yeah. Jeez, so much pain. This is so much, yeah. Performance is so good. Yeah, every Actually, performance well, here is wonderful. Everybody's good, yeah. Yeah, I can see the they dad's like slightly like bouncing up and down. Yeah, me too. She's dressing like her mother a bit. That <laughs> shot. I know what you're thinking, but they asked me to attend. They were bringing skeptics in and scientists, so I went. And what I experienced there, Annie, was truly. Okay, and he looked permanently changed by the end of it. I know what you're thinking. I do. Watch us. The audience is all planted. I approached him. She conjured my crest. No, no, no. I know. Smile is. I know. Annie, Annie. I wouldn't believe it either. I. Yes. Yes. <laughs> Please, if you are here with us, our eyes are so expressive. Please yeah. just try and slide the glass. Oh! Hi, Louie. Hi, Louie. How did you do that? Louie. Oh, my God. She could be imagining this, too, because we never, we don't know who Joan is. She's. 
read this out loud every syllable very carefully. You didn't kill her, Annie. Fuck. She isn't gone. What? <sighs> Holy shit, okay. Miniature. Yeah. It's shot like a miniature. I love it. Yeah, at this point we don't know which which is which now. It's the head. the head. The head. Oh my god. The... Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Do you want the plushie? No, I'm good. She's sleepwalking, right? Oh. Could be, I don't know. Yes, it's oh, oh no. That's Peter, right? Mom. What are you doing? I never wanted to be your mother. Huh? Why? I didn't feel like a mother. Kill me. I said I was trying to kill you. Why are you trying to kill me? <laughs> <laughs> Man, this is shot so. So she fell asleep in her bed for once. For once. <sighs> yeah, is this the middle of the night? Or is it early yeah. in the morning? We need our palms on the table and our fingers to touch. So, what are we doing here, Annie? Please. Please. Think about Charlie. If you can. Oh, fuck. Fuck. Sweetheart, please, please. I tried this 20 minutes ago and it worked. I will what not be bringing you down. I to show you. Show what? Fuck! I'm a... I'm a medium, okay? I... I... Charlie, it's Mommy. And Daddy and Peter. Charlie, that was so good. Now, Charlie, what I'd like for you to do is scary. No, I am not. Peter, Peter, listen. <laughs> there is no need to be scared. This is your sister. <laughs> What did you see? Oh, what's wrong with Annie's expression changed completely? And not yeah, Annie. Yeah, please stop. Me. What's Dad, happening? Why is everyone scared? Why are you scaring me? Make it fucking stop! Make it stop! I'm sweating. <laughs> oh, Peter felt something. But maybe the husband didn't feel anything. But she totally freaked out their son, that's for sure. Where's the head? Oh boy. Oh boy. 
I like the subtlety of the chandelier moving. As if like there's an earthquake about to happen. Mm. That's why her dad's moving, because she's shaking. Man, from his POV, <laughs> must be having the worst time. His wife seems to be going insane. His son's falling apart. His daughter dies to a pole. He's right, like... Has he imagined anything? We haven't seen his POV. No, not really. He's been the one keeping everybody together. But she just started standing there, so we don't know if she's sleepwalking again. Mm. Oh boy. <gasps> oh my god. <sighs> nice cut. Dad to like let's just move out and went to a different house. Yep. Huh? Or is that the dad? <laughs> oh, is she actually trying to stop it or trying to bring Charlie? I wonder if you haven't seen the dad's POV, really, because technically he doesn't have either one's genes. Mm, Genetics. That's right, because yeah. it's always been her. Yeah. Like her mom. And... It seems like she's going there for answers, like that urgency in her walk. Yeah. Oh. Oh boy. What? <laughs> oh, there's a camera there. There's a camera above that door uh -huh. looking at her. Does that some purpose? Why would they show that scene? She used to embroider. The mom used to do that. Yeah. Oh, that's the ah, necklace. Ah, the necklace. Okay, now what's going on? So she really is taking it seriously. What? Once. That's her. What the hell is going on? What? On... Oh no! I don't want him to die. That poor guy is, like, completely innocent. Oh, 
Someone did break into it. Remember? Uh, yeah, that yeah, was, yeah, that's right. That that's was what Joan. they mentioned at the beginning. The smell. Of the game life. Life. The smell. She's here this whole time. The grandma's body, right? Maybe she did it while she was sleepwalking. Dug yeah. it up and there's emblem is there. I don't know who's insane that I don't know what's going on. <laughs> I don't know if she's insane <laughs> or she's being like twisted to a pot. What the fuck? Is it real? Ah. Wow, this movie's fucked up. Jesus. Oh, jeez. Oh, it could get better. Oh, it's not gonna get better. <laughs> School's probably calling the family. Yeah. But where's... Oh, the dad... I mean, he's getting distracted. I feel so bad for the husband the most. Yeah, he's just trying to protect everyone. There's a body. Can't I, I mean I can't tell because the skin's all black and she's all distended, but the head is gone. And then there's more. It's, it's... Oh, you mean more than your mother's headless body? Of course there is. <laughs> it's like probably the most. <laughs> If I were him, I don't think I would leave my son's side, though. Yeah. Is she gonna trap him up there? I don't know. I, I really don't remember any... Even if I did, I want to tell you. <laughs> That's Joan. She didn't even mention knowing my mom, and I've never met her before, but she... Me. She told me about the seance, and she showed me how. Now look at this. See the symbol on... You, wasn't it? What? Well, wasn't yeah, of course. That would be the logical conclusion I'd make. Um, but she... I remember the day the cemetery girl, I said, oh, I won't tell her because she'd be worried. On this moment, I she's very this. rational. Caught on fire. My I God, if I was him, I would think she's crazy. It, I yeah. It. If we don't destroy this. How do we know something's not going to happen? I know, I feel like... <laughs> like... You are sick, Annie. I need to call the police. Wait, what the fuck? Ah. What the fuck? What the fuck? What the fuck? What, what the fuck? She got possessed too. Uh, I'm done. <laughs> Oh god. I just realized I think it's the moon. Charlie's just too small. gonna come up in this frame they're all they all are gonna kill themselves i guess <laughs> except for the poor dad the dad didn't... Uh. oh the poor dad did nothing wrong 
I'm shaking. Hello? Fuck, I turned on every light in the world. My like, yeah, the well, inner I'm... demons are coming. <laughs> I can see his dead dad. Like in the fireplace or something. Jeez. On the floor? Yeah, like... She didn't know, I think, when she threw that book in there. I guess when she gave past responsibility to him. Oh, I don't know. We'll see. Let's walk after. The guy from the, the beginning. funeral. Yeah. He was smiling at Charlie. Mm. Oh my god. Run. I'm gonna discover his grandma up there. the people standing there. Wake up, wake up. No, I don't want to know. What more is there? Fine, fuck. You can stomach this? <laughs> no, 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 no. the fuck is he still alive? I guess since he fell out of the roof, he's... He landed on soil. Oh. <laughs> what the fuck? Dude, if you can run, just do it. Is that the dog? No, was it? Oh, I thought that was a person lying there and the head was next to them. What is up with the small and naked people? <laughs> what the f- <laughs> That music makes it seem like he's going to a happier place. Even though it looks completely disturbing and... <laughs> the symbol is there. That's Charlie's head? Yeah. 
Well, what's left of it? Oh my god! Eight kings of hell. Wealth and good familiars. Into our will as we have bound ourselves for now and ever to yours. Hail, Hail. A miniature set. Hmm. What the fuck did I just watch? <laughs> Why I brought my own plushie? This is cool credits. Yeah, this is. Tony Collins, the oh, that's what she producer. Produces. I mean, her performance in this was incredible. Fucking slayed this role so hard. Yes. Watching summary videos is not an accurate, uh... What the fuck? Sawing off her own head. That was... I completely I'm never gonna forget forgot that. forgot about that part, but now I see why I avoided the movie in the first I'm place. I'm never gonna forget that scene. <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit. I completely shit. forgot until I saw it. I was like, oh shit. Holy moly. Oh, oh, and her oh. being in the corner, that was another reason... Those were oh the God. the two scenes I remember was Charlie getting her head and uh, the mom in a corner and those those were uh, the scenes I remember the most from the uh, Dead Meets Kill Count video all those years ago. So this whole time, if. Annie had let the grandmother become close to the firstborn Peter. Then I wonder if Peter would have lived. That means Peter must have died when he jumped out the window. And Charlie took over his body as a male host. He's still processing the movie. <laughs> I don't even know what to say. <laughs> Great acting. Fuck, that was a fucked up movie. That was that was messed up beyond belief. No, yeah, it is. It's a really messed up movie. It's not like it's not the thing or alien kind of horror. This is a different level of horror. It's very oh, unsettling. It's super unsettling. The photography in this is wonderful. Like the cinematography it was yes. so beautifully shot. Uh, every scene I expected something to happen. Just, there was a lot of tension in yes. those shots. Um, the music, when it happens, was pretty unusual, actually. Not, a, not your usual art orchestra or, or, a, or a scary movie soundtrack. Mm. What? I'm trying to process that ending. That whole sequence at the end. Oh, the poor husband. Oh, my lord. I wonder if the reason why the parents had to lose their heads was because they tried to stop the ritual. Like, the father, even unknowingly, had to, uh... But I don't know either. Or is it because the way Charlie lost hers? <laughs> Let's I... not lose our heads. Lose our heads? Ah! <laughs> I'm thinking chicken of the chicken, yeah, chicken run. <laughs> and I really think the mother was became rational. Towards the end there, before she was possessed. Like, she was completely horrified when she saw her husband light up. And then suddenly, you know, she she told him. You know, she went to find Joan. She looked that at transition the between the two. The, like, her acting like that and acting, like, to the possessed part. That transition was incredible. Yeah. Just how fast she switched. Yeah. Oh, man, there's few actors that can pull that off. She did that wonderfully. Yes. It just reminded me of, uh, it's gonna sound funny, but Catwoman, 
in uh, The Dark Knight uh, Rises. Mm-hmm. You know, she switches oh, yeah. from the maid to Catwoman instantly. In half weeks, Like, her, yeah. her facial expression. Wonderful. Yes. Here, though, she did it even quicker. Tony Collette, like, oh my god, she was incredible on this. Yeah, she's great. I don't know if I'm crazy <laughs> when the movie's crazy. <laughs> After watching it, I don't know if I'm crazy. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, jeez. I think overwhelmed with grief, she really did want to connect with Charlie. That's why she performed the seance. But then she realized it was hurting everyone in her family. And then she started to become suspicious of Joan after she went to visit Joan. I do find it interesting that, uh, that Charlie lost her head after she cut off that bird's head. Yeah. It's like a foreshadowing. Obviously, it's foreshadowing. Yeah, obviously, but. foreshadowing. But even Charlie knew, like, she drew the crown on a bird's head on some level. She wanted to see her grandma before she died. Her grandma was the one who took care of her, is what seems yeah. to be implied. That's just horrifying. I remember, like, reading um, a discussion years later that someone pointed out that the mom may have been trying to save Peter. Like, there's still a tiny bit of her left in there. She was trying to stop him from going up into the attic. But I don't know how much of that is true or not. I guess you could argue that she's trying to stop him from going into the attic. Wait, yeah. I don't know. It's hard to tell. Man, that scene though where she's banging her head against the wall there. Yeah, it, really I mean, creepy. it could be like she was trying to get in to get, get him like some part of her. But then suddenly, you know, she was overcome with all that possession. Fucking okay, jeez. Yeah. Look. I'm kind of I'm trying to like figure out where like the line between supernatural and imagined like blurs here. This movie seemed quite supernatural to me. Oh if, yeah, for sure. If like Peter can suddenly be possessed by Charlie, but it's because like when she threw the book in the first time, the sides of the book got covered, so she got covered. But then with her husband, she threw the entire book in there, so he suddenly lit up completely, just like the book. Fucking hell. So I guess when she passed the torch to him, like she wanted him to throw the book out, the ha- the I don't know the spirits thought, okay, let's let's uh, do him in as well. Her sawing her own head off is definitely not a scene that I completely. And they didn't even that show one. that. They didn't even show it. They just heard, you could hear the thump and you could tell she was done. I was like, yeah, that's oh that's my true. God. <sighs> For her, what a messed up family. Like, the queen didn't even care that her own family. Do we see Joan and, like, part of the naked group people? She was not naked, but she was there. She was the one bowing in the front. Oh, uh, yeah. Okay. So uh, she cursed them or something. Yes, yeah, she did. Oh, the acting was, like, incredible by everyone. Yeah. Especially the son. Actually, he did a really good he job, too. He did a too. great job, yeah. Like, especially when he got possessed in the school for a second. Mm. Thunk, thunk. Jeez. That was really creepy. And then he was, like, trying to fight her, I guess? Is that why he was hitting himself on the desk? It could be that Charlie was trying to kill him. All that, too, yeah. The spirits were trying to kill him. That's yeah, why yeah. they wanted him to get out. They wanted to put Charlie in that body. That's why she, That's why uh, Annie was telling her husband that they're after Peter. She was rational then. It yeah. was very rational. But to the husband, obviously, obviously she seems insane. Obviously to him, yeah, because from the get-go, she was already sleeping outside, performing seances. So, yeah, from his perspective, I don't blame him for being suspicious. Fucking hell. Actually, there weren't a lot of super jump-scare moments. The jump-scare moments were the, like the, the bird hitting the window, stuff like that. That's true, yeah. It's more... Uh, this was more... It showed you the jump-scare. This like, was more oh, psychological. Fuck. Yeah. Yeah. You saw the jump scare about to happen. Like, they show it right there. I was like, oh, no. So the jump scare isn't when it happens. It's the tension between that. Yes. When it blows off. <laughs> Jeez. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. So I misremember this movie. I remember think I remember Peter jumping off, jumping out the window, and I thought he lived. But I don't remember anything after that. So I was quite surprised. Like, huh? He was actually... He lost, <laughs> like so to speak, the good guys lost. But I don't know any good to guys the, here. <laughs> like if we're, if I was going to define them by good and bad, well, the family but, definitely lost. <laughs> yeah, exactly. It's like lots of horror movies. The 
Joan just happens to meet her after she loses her daughter. So she was like watching the, her. She was waiting yeah, to she, pounce on her. Yep. I wonder if she was in the meeting and we didn't check. We gotta look at that. Mm, maybe that she was the empty seat one. True. I kept expecting something with that empty seat. I wonder if that was on purpose. Yeah. Man, the soundtrack was really good though, being unsettling. So but the eerie. sound design was what really was From really the way great. Beginning. Yeah. With the flies or the uh like the creak of the wood when someone's in the room with you. Yes. Fuck. Well, what's sad is that her mother was trying to use her entire family. Yeah. Not not Annie. Annie's mother was trying to use the entire family and bring King Payman back. Mm. The demon god. The Payman. demon god. We only learned about him in the last section of the movie. Yes. Fucking hell. So who were all those naked people? I guess the servants. And that means the queen. Since he was at the funeral, one of them was. Yeah. Uh, the servants of the king, huh? Yeah. And did we see the grandmother at the end, or was she like in a different body? She's headless. Ah. The, the headless body was lying right there, like doing the bow with everyone else. I thought that was the father. Oh, I could be. But the... I think you're right. That might have been the mother. Because yeah. the father was... The father is not... Related me. to them. Yeah. yeah. You know, after all, it is a hereditary mm. yep. <laughs> uh, thing going on. Yep. So they all have that symbol. So I wonder what would happen if Aunt, uh, Charlie hadn't died. Oh, I'm dumb. What? That's why they had that symbol on that pole. Because he kills her on that pole later. Mmm. But how do they know? They're demons, okay? They can arrange stuff. <laughs> <laughs> so Charlie, from the way beginning, was trying to possess Peter because he, when he was trying to smoke, he even said like his throat was closing in. So it's not trauma. She was already trying to do something. Yeah. From the way beginning, even before this was before the séance was performed, right? And perhaps performing the séance sort of opened the floodgates. So to speak, yeah, I think so. Man, that scene though, where her head like rolls forward as a bowling ball, very well, very well cut there. Jeez. Yes. God, that scene was so fucked. Oh man, the ending scene. Yep. Overall, that was a very good movie. <laughs> oh my god, I don't know what to call that a very good movie. I'm gonna watch it for a long time. Never gonna watch it again. Time. I think I'm good. Yeah. I think yeah, exactly. I'm uh, I'm good on the whole watching people cut their heads off. Their own heads off. Are you happy I didn't warn you? Or do you think I should have warned you? I don't know what to expect. <laughs> that was a... Uh, it was such a psychological messed up movie. It was a very messed up movie. Yeah. Very entertaining though. True. I want to see what the director's done because his name's familiar. Midsommar? He did Midsommar. And that's what I want to watch next. Oh God. <laughs> I guess he likes his uh, scary movies. Thanks for watching your reaction. <laughs> Hope you guys enjoyed us being scared. Being psychologically afraid of all sorts of scenes. That was, This was a real fucked up movie to begin with. And uh, I'm not sure I'll ever watch it again. But certainly a movie that I won't forget. Mm. You know, you were earlier like, how can you watch this? I was, I was thinking, why am I watching this? <laughs> it's just one of those scenes where you're like... You this is horrifying, but you can't take your eyes away yeah, from it. Yeah, that, that was basically yeah. me. I was, yeah. <laughs> I was like, was I had moments. to see this play out because it was yeah. absolutely wild. Yeah, exactly. Like, oh my god! <laughs> like they're actually doing this. <laughs> so fucked. Up. I wonder how they did that actually. Jeez, I guess she, maybe they had like a rope around. So when she pulls it, I think someone said that she may have the mom is still inside, like still alive. You know, that's why I said like she was trying to save Peter. Trying to prevent him from going upstairs. And then in that moment, she was doing that. Like, somebody said you can kind of see her expression or a wow. teardrop Her acting is fucking incredible. She's, like, flipping back and forth. Yeah, she's great. Ugh. And the sleepwalking was probably her being possessed. Ah, bit by bit, yeah. It could be, yeah. yeah. Yeah, all those years, right? Yes. Ah, interesting. Okay. Well, what a messed up movie. Hope you guys enjoyed our reaction to this. And thanks for watching. And uh, yeah.
Thanks for watching. Our full reaction will be on our Patreon and the next movie as well, whatever it will be. And uh, thanks for watching. Take care and have a good day.